Hey all my air sign friends and welcome to my channel. I'm doing your Monday, September 10th, 2018 daily love reading. This is for singles, um, sun, moon, rising, and Venus, Gemini, Libra, and Aquarius. Gemini, Libra, and Aquarius. In that order, please. Spirit, angels, what message do you have for our air signs in love? Who are single? Gemini, Libra, Aquarius. Okay. Okay, Gemini. You have the Ten of Wands in reverse. Libra, you guys have the Prince of Pentacles in the upright. And Aquarius, you have the Seven of Pentacles. Beautiful. The bottom of the deck is the King of Cups and the Moon. Okay. Sorry, my nose is really itchy. So, let's see here. Our single Gemini. You guys, um, you're holding on to a lot of um, guilt about a relationship that ended, um, causing like an emotional, uh, an like somebody's very, very emotional in this situation. You just couldn't handle um, the relationship anymore. You couldn't do it any further. Um, also, some some secrets could have come out about the relationship, but but you're feeling. I feel like you're feeling guilty. Um, let's see here. Let's get some male female clarifiers here. Gemini men. Gemini females. Okay. I couldn't help but look at the bottom of the deck. The Wheel of Fortune. So you guys, great things are coming for you guys. Um, for you, Gemini men, you... Uh, you put down the burden of a past relationship. You do feel guilty about the way it ended, about the things that were hidden from this person, but you are going to extend your energy to somebody else today. You are going to offer um, your love. Yeah, you did go um, within. You did allow things to heal. You did become enlightened to what it is that you want out of a relationship, and you found somebody that you feel you can offer your cup to because this person you have a lot of feelings for. Um, this is a water sign female for this group of you. Um, it doesn't have to be in their sun, moon, rising, or Venus. It can be anywhere on their chart, but they have water in their chart. They're also not afraid to show their emotions, uh, to show how they feel about people. So Gemini men, I do see you um, making a love offer today. Gemini female, you guys have the devil and the magician. Holy crap. You're getting out of a relationship that has the devil, the energy, and the um, the magician. So either you were manipulative and sneaky, or they were. This is somebody that is definitely um, working out of their dark side, um, lying, being sneaky, toxic. This is a toxic relationship. Um, you're having a hard time putting it behind you. I do feel for this group of you, this was done to you and you're having a hard time putting it behind you, um, healing from it because of all the secrets and lies and deceit. For a different group of you, I feel you're feeling guilty about what you did to somebody, about uh, the energy that you um, gave to them. Unfortunately, this is very few of those people that I feel because I feel that this person was a water sign that did this um, to you. But this is definitely the shadow side and manipulation, um, just pure toxicity. It's time to let those hurts of the past go, Gemini females. Um, allow these hurts to heal um, and to move forward. Okay. Libra. Libra men. That's way too many. One card, please. Lib Libra men. Okay. 
Thank you. Libra females. Okay. So Libras, you guys are going to um, present somebody with an offer. You're going to make an offer to somebody, something tangible um, in this energy of this new moon. You do feel kind of uh, back and forth with your emotions. You're not quite sure if you should make this offer or not, but the energy shift is just really pushing you. For some of you, I feel you are um, making an offer, a proposal. You guys are proposing to somebody um, to marry you. For another group of you, I feel that you feel this connection is very spiritual um, and that you can see this person as being a spouse one day. Uh, for for some of you, I feel that um, this is ascending to a higher level. Um, you are wanting to um, to ask somebody either to to be committed to you, to go from being single into a commitment. That is for the majority of you. Um, for you Libra females, you are breaking out of this energy of feeling trapped. You, uh, yeah, you're making an offer to somebody, um, because you're no longer feeling like you are trapped by a situation. Somebody's going to come into you very quickly or into your energy very quickly with this moon. You guys are manifesting each other. You guys um, are wanting each other to come into your lives and they are coming today. Very positive. Okay. Aquarius. You guys, um, you guys are just really working on yourself, um, putting in the work. You're being patient. You are taking the time to tend your own garden. You are uh, manifesting very beautifully blessings into your life. Uh, somebody really broke your heart. But with this new moon energy, things are going to shift and somebody's coming into you. If not today, within the next two weeks. Okay, Aquarius men. Thank you. Aquarius females. Thank you. Okay. So yeah, uh, Aquarius men, you guys are, like I said, you're just working on yourself. You're planting your own garden. You're weeding out the weeds and um, you're not worried about anybody right now. You're just worried about yourself. You are just going to continue to be patient and allow love in when it naturally gets here. Um, you are really releasing with this new moon energy and you're trying to find balance again. For Aquarius females, um, you are wanting a new beginning with an earth sign. You're really trying to manifest this. Um, you're putting in all the work. You're self-healing. You're really just working on yourself, which is beautiful. Uh, you want somebody who's grounded and who loves their family, who takes care of their family. It is coming for you. It's just not here yet. This is with an earth sign, Aquarius. Um, it is coming in. It's just not the time. So spirit is um, urging you to be patient because it will come. Um, use this new moon energy to keep releasing, to keep healing and um, allow that heal from that emotional situation that you just came out of. And, and this earth sign will be returning to you very shortly um, within the next uh, month or so for this group of you. But, but it is going to the word it's worth the wait. They're worth waiting for. In the words of Dorian Virtue, it's worth waiting for. So, um, positive energy for you guys as well. I will pull a romance angels card for you. Single air signs. Your angels will adore single air signs. Need to know for Monday, September 10th. Attraction. You attract romantic love by enjoying this moment fully. So, um, yeah, just enjoy, enjoy being you. Enjoy the time. Um, oh my gosh, look at what's on the bottom of the deck. <laughs> Worth waiting for. Divine timing is at work in your love life. So, um, you are going to attract the one that's meant for you. The universe is trying very hard to put your paths back into, uh, into each other's uh, life and di divine timing is at work. So just be patient and um, 
just have fun because you're more romantically attractive when you are out being yourself, having fun and enjoying life. So I hope you guys have a beautiful Monday. As always, I send you my love and may God bless.